My name is Kylie and this happened when I was 16 years old. I had two bullies named Alger and AJ. I wanted to tell my mom about my two bullies, but she'd probably hit me with a slipper if I did. I hated walking to school, not because I'm tired of walking, but because AJ and Alger would bully me on the side of the bridge. They'd take my money and threaten me that if I told anyone, they'd hurt me. One day, as usual, they took my money and threatened me, but before they went, I yelled at their back. Screw this, I'm telling the teachers about this, I said. AJ then kicked me and I passed out. When I woke up, it was already nighttime. I was laying on the floor the whole day and AJ and Alger were nowhere to be seen. I just went home and didn't bother to tell my mom what happened. The next day I wake up and feel happy that it's the weekend and I don't have to deal with AJ and Alger. Someone then knocked on the door. When I opened it, it was AJ and Alger. They smelled so bad. AJ just told me to come with them and they'll treat me, but said it in a cold voice. I was so hungry, so I went with them. I thought we were going to a restaurant, but we just went to the bridge. Both of them were standing in front of me and staring at me wildly. Honestly, I was more scared of the smell of them because they smelled like corpses. I wanted to vomit so bad, so I went to the side of the bridge, and then I saw it. AJ and Alger's corpses were down the bridge with their necks snapped because of the fall. That's when all the memories from yesterday flashed back. The reason why AJ kicked me yesterday is because I pushed both of them. Her feet hit me. That's why I fell down and my head hit a rock and I passed out. All of that happened yesterday. I looked back at AJ and Alger and they're getting closer and closer. Both of them then snapped their neck, their own neck, and just ran right towards me. When they disappeared, the smell was gone, but their bodies down the bridge still have that smell and always will.